First step in the process is cleaning. For this, we will use Eat Clean 163 at 100% concentration. To clean the panel using the Eat Clean 163, we use a sponge, dip the sponge into the cleaner, and then wipe it on the panel, similar to washing dishes or washing your car. After two to five minutes of working the cleaner in, we can rinse the part. This can be done by running water over the part, or for larger parts, using a sponge and clean water and wiping the clean water onto the part. The next step is to apply the Instablack 333 gel. The Instablack 333 gel is used at 100% concentration. To apply the gel, dip your sponge into the Instablack 333 gel, and then wipe the gel onto the part. This will be similar to the cleaning process that we used earlier. Keep working the Instant Black 333 gel into the part until you have a nice, even, black surface. Here is our panel after we have been applying the Instant Black 333 gel for a couple of minutes. Once we have achieved an even black color, we are now ready to rinse the panel. This can be done by running water over the panel or by dipping a sponge in some clean water and wiping the water onto the panel until the Mix of Light 333 has been rinsed off. Once the panel has been rinsed off, the panel can now be dry. This can be done by using forced hot air or by using a rag or a towel. Once the panel is dry, you can apply the rust preventative oil. EPI has a variety of rust preventative oils that you can choose from. After the oil has been applied, the part can then be let set out to air dry, or you can use forced hot air to dry the part. Instablack 333 Gel from Electrochemical Products Incorporated.